What's up everyone, it's Tyler from K1 Speed. Today we have another amazing Cars and Carts feature. We're here in Ontario, California. I have Jose over here with us. And uh, you brought something ridiculous for me, man. What is this? So as you can see, this is a 2020 Supra. leave you guys hanging short here. Jose, this Supra is insane, dude. <laughs> thank you, thank you. So uh, this Supra, there's a lot of work that was done to it. It's definitely like not stock. <laughs> so first thing first, when I got the car, my first mod was actually, believe it or not, I have a Bore Winner top mount turbo, pushing 700 to the wheel. 700 horsepower to the wheel in this crazy thing. Yeah. Definitely not just pushing the look. After I did, you know, the, basically the engine work, then I went to suspension wheels with the kit and the wrap. This work here, we actually did it in two weeks. All this in two weeks, that's insane. Yeah, two weeks just before, because we had to have it in the Enos Tech booth for SEMA for this past year of 2021. They was telling me earlier about all the special little things with this kit. You're saying it's a Liberty Walk kit, yeah. right? How many of these things are in the United States? Kind of with my hand probably. Yeah. yeah, so we're actually one of the first ones who actually did this kit i mean along the side with the wheels with the ld97 they collaborated with liberty walks so this is like one of the first sets too so not only the kit is liberty walk but also the color of the vehicle which this color is actually from katu from japan if you guys are aware it's called ken mary blue everything's liberty walking <laughs> now there's some couple things that i'd like to point out and i point this out with every single build the wing this wing on the liberty walk kit is awesome i'm a sucker for swan neck wings i did one myself this is actually the first one that they made, I mean, uh, obviously for SEMA too. The, the Liberty Walk kit, like it comes with a regular wing, like it's good, but let's do the swan neck and here it is. I mean, it looks amazing. <laughs> Can't go wrong with the good old swan neck. The devil is definitely in the details. You even have the carbon fiber vents, carbon fiber mirror caps. And then a uh, Studio RSR cage, just to give it some accent, you know. Yeah, let's go talk to them about <laughs> this. Let's tell them about your trunk setup. So if you guys can see, this thing is extremely low. It doesn't just drive that way, right? Yeah, no. So basically, I'm on airlift performance. I'll show I'll show you guys the trunk setup. You have your your tank right here. Two compressors. Two compressors. Studio RSR cage. I think I cannot drive this car like without bags in the street. There's no way the bump, the lip bumper sticks out way too much. It's an expensive kit. I didn't want to risk that. So bags was the only way for to go in this build. The cage well, it was more like for stability and looks. I needed some accent, like so you can see through the window. This is driving behind me, you can see it, you know? <laughs> and I'll show you the engine bay too while we're at it, you know? Yeah. So it's not too fancy right now, but... Not too fancy, just 700 horsepower. It's the big turbo right there, bore winner. Huge turbo, look at this is my hand. Look how big this thing is, ridiculous. This is all the dock race, basically what it comes with with the kit. Basically everything's stainless steel. Wrap the manifold so it doesn't heat. Aftermarket cold pipe, we have a methanol injection here. He just did a quick hit on that. That's the secret sauce here. You guys are the running meth on here. Burning. Yeah, so methanol injection by Snow Performance. Believe it or not, I actually daily this car. It's no uh, garage queen. <laughs> no garage queen, no stranger to speed. So let's translate that into some cars. You think you're fast on the track? I mean, let's do it, let's do it. I'm up to the challenge. To everybody out there watching again we're in ontario california if you guys are watching at home and want to try and race this track for yourself we are on track two today and uh jose said we're racing for pink slips he said if i beat him i could take the supra <laughs> <laughs> that's on when you're ready i'm ready go <laughs> <laughs> okay jose <laughs> I was <laughs> <laughs> copy your, your strategy. Yeah. You made one mistake, so I'll let you go. I want to get right. you on a good, clean path. Today's episode is sponsored by Jose's Rap Shop. He said, if I win today, everybody's getting a free rap. <laughs> <laughs> I'm right behind you. <sighs> How? It's all about the driving line, Jose. I said, I'm going to have to start coming more often so I can kick you up next time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see what you're doing. You see what I'm doing? 
Yeah, hey, you get that good grip. Oh, what was that? Your uh, your microphone's falling off. Okay, I'm gonna clip this kind of on your shirt a little bit. This is actually good, you know. There's some people over there that you know they work a lot or yeah. just to get your mind off things, you know. This is like a therapy, you know, for all you car people and everything. This, you know, this is something that you guys should try. You know, this let's go. <laughs> oh, this man didn't even give me a count up. <laughs> Let me show you a thing or two, Jose. Ah! See that? Inside, <laughs> outside, woo! Oh, too much speed! Uh, yeah. It's this turn right here where it's the hardest. I'm gonna see if I can catch Jose. Well, good Jose. I don't know, how much you want? Jose, negotiate the terms. You want half a lap, a whole lap? <laughs> Go for it, give it to me. I'm gonna see if I can catch you. Right. Everybody comment down below if they think I can catch him. Slowing down! <laughs> That's it, that's a wrap. We'll call it a race here, Jose. No! Yeah. <laughs> it was a good race. We had a good oh, time. Oh, damn, you're like right here. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, that was fun. Now that the race is done, that was your first time on track too. How are yes. you feeling? Uh, <laughs> you know, it's definitely like exercise. Like how I told you guys, I mean, this is something that you guys should try out, you know, car enthusiasts over there. This is like a must, you know, it's not all about being in the street, you know, or bring your friends out here and actually settle it right here, you know? Keeping it off the streets. There you go, Jose. I like that message. Let's get our race results and see what the breakdown is, Jose, and we can uh, tell the people what we got. Jose's claiming that the race results are fixed, but here we go. Here we have it. Jose, break it down for us. Give us the lap times. Yeah, like a, we'll just like say, so for me, yeah. it'll be a 24.741 as my best lap. What's your best lap, Jose? 26.2. 26.2. Average lap, I'm a 35.121, and you're a 34. Ah, see that? because I waited. I yeah. gave Jose the sauce over here. There we go. I mean, well deserved. <laughs> well, I hope you had fun. Thank you so much for coming out, Jose. We appreciate you bringing out the Supra. Hope you had fun. Nice. Do you have anything else to say to the people here? I have nothing else to say, but this is something that you guys should try. I mean, this, I can't stop saying it. <laughs> Jose's pumped. He's going to be back. You guys know how this goes. Who do you think we should race next? Put it down in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll catch you in the next video. We're out of here. Alrighty, that's a wrap. Peace. <laughs>